I booked this facilitator training not for the purpose of becoming a facilitator. Uh, last July, I did a two-day training workshop or a two-day workshop with Alex. And after completing that workshop, I just needed to do more. Alex has to be or is probably the, the most authentic facilitator I've ever experienced. I've been in many circles such as this before, um, lots of retreats, lots of workshops, and I had never come across anyone who can create a space like Alex did and learning his ways and his little tricks and his tools, but also just seeing his ability to be so vulnerable in a group, in, in a space like this and learning from that. Um, I feel a lot more confident at being able to run these sorts of groups now and creating, recreating some of the magic that we experienced here um, myself. So my intention coming was not resisting the ice and learning to be able to hold the dominant energy I want to be in life going into the ice. So in life I want to hold love and presence and groundedness so I can now stand at an ice bath waiting to go in, look at the ice with respect, feel whatever's coming up, go to my dominant energy, step in and hold that energy for as long as I need to in the ice bath. And for me that's a beautiful metaphor for life. One of the biggest things we learned was how to authentically relate and create that with a group of people. I can honestly say I fell in love with 16 other strangers on this three-week workshop. I have never seen into other people's souls the way we got to see into each other's souls because um, of the authentic relating that Alex is able to facilitate. And I now feel confident on how to create that myself. So I'm really excited to bring that to others um, because it's truly magic. And another thing that I realized, um, I need to bring this to the gay community. As a gay man, um, I've struggled with relating to other gay people because of the trauma. There's a lot of trauma in our community. Um, there's a lot of hurt, a lot of sadness, and I just watch how most people deal with that. And rather than going in and trying to be with what's coming up, they shut it all down and seek lots of external ways to manage that pain. So I really felt a calling to bring this to my community and try and bring them some of the relief that I found through this, these sorts of modalities. Um, such, such healing things to be able to offer to others. I feel like I've been given a gift and it's not right to sit on it and not do something with it. So that's why I'm going home with a bit of apprehension because I know there's work to be done. Overall, I cannot recommend this workshop enough. It's the best workshop I've ever done and the one that I can't imagine anyone regretting doing. So wholeheartedly, I'd say give this a go.